Hey kids, Inverted Cow here. Welcome to Minecraft. Okay, yep, the world just ended. Yes, we understand that. Thank you. Uh, <laughs> this is a mod pack called um, Project Ozone. Apparently, you start out in, well, a rainstorm. <sighs> Minecraft rain. <laughs> Does it ever end? <laughs> um, I saw another YouTube person in playing this mod pack and it kind of caught my attention because it's not its focus is highly on technology and not like magics especially things like blood magic and uh, Ars Magica and crap like that that really honestly I, um, I almost find repulsive uh, most of those uh, I will not use in a mod pack. Um, so this one does not seem to have any of those in it. And it kind of, that's what got my attention. Um, it's also, it's a skyblock map. Ooh, there's a stuck in the head of the cow. Um, oops, let's see if we can learn how to walk here. There we go. Yeah, you start out on a dirt island. Um, and a, pretty much a fall to your death in every direction. Um, it's hardcore quest mod. And I figure, let's give her a go. So let's see if I can remember which button turns my point of view back in here. There we go. And which one turns on my settings? <clears throat> now you start out with a bunch of stuff here. Uh, I just want to make sure that I do this sign right. It says set your game mode to survival and do starting inventory load. Okay, slash game mode and GME M O D E zero zero. Enter. Oh. No. Uh, try that again without the cat. All right. Slash S T A S T A R T I N G I N B space L O A D today in typing not a good thing starting I N V load all right what do we start with okay we start with a mod pack that has probably the most annoying mod in the entire world. <laughs> There's one that's going to get deleted. I'm sorry. I'm pretty certain that that is uh, something to do with, let's see, mods. Will it show me mods? Mod. There we go. I'm pretty sure that is better. Um, I can't remember the name of that one. Um, it's something to do with, um, your achievements and yeah I don't really care if I achieve anything on Minecraft I'm sorry it's not my big deal uh, so that one's gone um, now as you can see there is quite a few on here that I've, I've never even looked at I uh, don't even know what four space is never heard about it another one bites the dust uh, okay applied energistics uh, most loves this one. I've never really too cared much about it. Some people can do amazing, wonderful things with it. Me, it's like, meh, whatever. 
uh, aroma core, yeah, the aroma, uh, 1997, I'm not too keen on his mod, but he does have a dimensional for mining, I guess, which is what he's got in here. Uh, never heard of the Aurora Cascades. Um, Auto Packager, we've used this in uh, Crash Landing. Um, Bobblicious, Bobbles, not really. Buildcraft, um, I actually I really enjoyed Buildcraft, but I know he went and did a lot of rework to his stuff uh, from version 6. Uh, Minecraft version 6 to Minecraft version 7, so I'm really curious to see what he's actually come up with. Um, my favorite old wooden pipes and pipes and stuff. Um, some people like the really fancy ones from um, like uh, what do you call it? Um, Ooh, Twilight Forest is on here. We're definitely going to have to see if we can get in there. Um, some people like the ones from things... I can't think of the name of the mods right now because it's been so long since I've played Minecraft. Um, Project Red. I've never played with Project Red. Um, what is the mod where you just have stuff just teleport spot, spot, spot uh, in your inventory? Yeah, uh, I don't like that one. Um... I kind of like seeing the stuff moving around. That's why I like the build craft ones. Um, so you're probably actually going to see me using the build craft pipes uh, all over the place. Um, I saw carpenter's blocks there. Um, I really like the carpenter's blocks. <laughs> That's one of my favorites. Um, what else we got in here? Botania. I've never played with. Uh, again, build craft. Um, so we can, we're going to have some fun with build craft chisel, which is uh, decorative blocks, pretty much purely decorative computer craft gives me those nice little turtles draconic evolution, uh, never played with ender IO never even heard of. Um, this is a total new one for me. Uh, ender storage we've used before. Uh, the original design for the ender chest, uh, ender tank, and I love the ender pouch. So we're going to definitely be building some of those really soon. Uh, equivalent energistics. Not even sure what that does. Okay. Ex nihilo. Yeah, we've dealt with this uh, in the past. This is basically your skyblock resources. Um... The X asterisk rebirth now, X asterisk was an add-on to X nihilo. Um, it gives you power sieve, the ability to build uh, nether portal or end portals, um, things like that. Um, I tried using it, but it requires. Uh, I tried using it in the mod pack that I actually built, but it is a dependent on a mod that I did not want to have in there, but apparently you got no choice. Um, I can't remember what it's called off the top, but I believe it is um, Thermal Expansion. That's the one. Yeah. Thermal expansion, this is how they're all tied together. You can't do one without the other. Uh, see what else we got in here. Immersive engineering, never played with this before. Iguana tweaks, tinker... Okay, so you're talking tinker contra construct is in here somewhere. Um, so, yeah, that's good. I like using tinkers. Loot bags. I find that loot bags are is really kind of cheaty. Um... Because you end up with all kinds of mob drops that really are just ridiculous. Uh, magical crops, armory. Okay, so magical crops is in here. I've played with them a little bit. Um, magnetic craft, never heard of. Mantle has a book. Okay. 
Uh, Minecraft frames, never played with mechanism. We've played with mechanism before. Um, metallurgy is in here. All oh, this stupid Minecraft one is in here. Oh, jeepers. Um, MFR is in here. Uh, I do like my uh, MFR. There's a lot of things in here that actually functions really nicely and is not dependent on a lot of other mods. Uh, Natura is in here, so we're going to get some mystery little bush, berry bushes and stuff right there. Uh, nether ores, well that's great. Nuclear craft, uh, it's another one I've never really played with. Open modular turrets, never heard of. Open blocks, of course, that's uh, fairly common. Uh, Pam's Harvest Craft, well, considering the fact that Mouse is a patron of Pam's, uh, I'm not going to say how much that she likes that one. Portal Guns, um, love-hate relationship with them, really like things like the long fall boots. Um, haven't really played with a lot of the other stuff here. The Portal Guns uh, are handy to have, though. Um, yeah. Uh, Project Red, never have I really ever dwelled with Project Red whatsoever, so that's going to be kind of interesting if we actually get into this. Random things. <coughs> Excuse me. Random things. Mm, this looks like an add-on to open blocks. I've never really played with this at all. Um, RF tools. It's one I've never heard of. There you go. Simple achievements. Um, I'm pretty sure this is the one that has the, that makes the fireworks. If it is, I'm probably going to get rid of it. Um, unless it's part of part of the hardcore quest book here, which we'll take a look at in a second. Oops! Oh, crud! Uh, <clears throat> let's see. Tinker's construct, thermal rig exp expansion. Okay, yeah. Uh, this is needed. Thermal expansion is needed for X Astris, but um, I use a few of the things in here, some of the dynamos and such, but eh, take it or leave it. Uh, translocator, I have seen this before, but um, never used it. Tree go growing simulator and Z, to Z tones. Never heard of this one. Never, never even heard of this one before. Um, so there's a whole lot of stuff in here I've never played with. Simple jack packs I've played with before. Um, easy things to do with. Storage drawers I've played with before. Uh, I kind of actually like them. There's a few things in here you can do with them that are really handy. Um... If I remember correctly, you can actually connect uh, drawers together so they actually function as a unified inventory. Um, it's been a long time since I played with it, so I might have to do some some snooping around. But there we go, and it starts us out with two saplings, a torch, a diamond, a quest book, a sign. All right. <clears throat> a pack is fired by two other sky related mod packs uh, so much tech has been added to the pack because the creator loves tech more than magic yeah uh, there's something that the creator and I the creator of this mod pack and I have to really agree on hardcore quest mod is only a guide in which will not determine what you have to do you have the freedom to do the quests I have made I'll consider 100% complete of the pack is completed when both the hardcore quest and simple achievements are complete. So we have to do the simple achievements. So we have to leave that in here. Uh, in this pack, NEI and the internet will probably help a lot. 
go forth and explore Project Ozone. Ever since Error 404 destroyed the world, feedback is always welcome. And I am suppose that's the name of the mod maker. Okay, mod maker, your challenge has been accepted by the inverted cow. I am going to do 100% of your pack. Click here to start. As soon as I remember how to play Minecraft. Because everybody who knows me knows that I got totally Minecraft and burned out when I tried to make my own mod pack. And honestly, yeah. Start class. In the beginning. Open it up. A random act of kindness. Just in case it doesn't rain in a free bucket, listen to the music disc with the Ozone Resource Pack active. Okay. It gives me a water bucket, a chance cube, the jukebox, the music disc. Now, I understand that these chance cubes are uh, random and can be very nasty. Oak sapling, essence berry bushes. Well, we're going to take the essence berry bushes. You know how it goes. Where's the wood? Yeah, that's what we're going to start with. We're going to crank up a bunch of these things. The wood trees and silkworms. We're going to get the mob grinder. We're going to have to start thinking about a mob grinder. Pound the ground. Shift right click grass to dirt to obtain pebbles. This only works in garden of glass. 64 cobblestone and if I shift right click so hold shift and I guess I gotta have an empty hand or what oh that's right because I changed my settings boom all right so that's how we collect stones huh. it stopped raining yay hooray So, uh, according to my timer here, it's already been 15, well, almost 18 minutes. Um, I'm going to say, welcome to um, Project Ozone. This is the, the, the prelude episode. Uh, I haven't done anything whatsoever except for start up the game, turn on the thing, and sit in the rain and talk for a few minutes. And as soon as I remember what button does what, we'll be off to the races. There we go. Hey, look at that. And that. Whoa. All right, kids. <laughs> this is inverted cow. <coughs> if you dare, I'm playing Minecraft. Ah. Uh. See you next episode. <laughs> Thanks for watching.